but we cannot give up on the youths and we need help Strive, one of the organizations working to restore peace and quell the violence among rival factions in the capital, was praised for its role in the national parade being free of serious violent incidents. There had been an eruption in gang activity on the Chaussee Road mere weeks before the national parade, according to member and former president of New Village Development Group, Michael Tucker Phillips. The request to intervene came from the top cop. Commissioner Police wanted us to assist in helping them have a violent free carnival, which we know we could have done, all right? So we, we had the young boys, we spoke to them, both sides, I and my Strive family. We have Ricky, we have Steve, we have all other members, Laurie, Dan Man. We spoke to the young boys, let them know what time it is. And please allow the revelers and St. Lucia and the foreigners to have a peaceful carnival. Community leaders also played their part in speaking to the youth in the area to help prevent incidents of violence to allow for a smooth and peaceful jump up. One leader believes that authorities also need to target the schools. We have to start off in the schools first as we always keep telling them and we always keep crying out for help and we're not getting no help, no assistance. But we're still going forward. We cannot stop crime. But if we could prevent it before it happened, that's our work. Having registering successes for the Carnival Parade, some question whether this can be a long-term solution to keeping the peace. Stride members called for greater family support and intervention. We need government intervention. We need the private sector intervention. You understand? Because to make these things happen and make it run, it's about finance. Well, the message I, I could send uh, is to have more family intervention in what's taking place. Because enough times we, we, keep meeting, we, keep, we keep meetings for these young men and the family, the mothers and fathers do show up. You understand? So I don't really the police have to arrest some of them, have them lock up until the parents don't show up, don't release them. If that's the way we could get the parents to come. Because they, they do come to the meetings. Most of them, some come, but most of them do come at all, at all, at all, at all, at all. Law enforcement officials reported a relatively safe carnival season apart from a few scuffles. Deputy Police Commissioner Ronald Phillip, during the announcement of parade winners, commended Stride for their efforts in speaking to the young people in the city to facilitate a peaceful and enjoyable carnival celebration. Gina Filippi, HDS News Force.